Hi, and welcome back to this introductory series on Commotion. In this video, we will briefly present the user interface of the Commotion Electronic Laboratory journal Commotion ELN. The abbreviation ELN stands for Electronic Laboratory Notebook. After logging into the ELN, the following overview page will appear. The exact login procedure for the Commotion ELN will be explained in detail in a separate video. Alternatively, instructions for the login procedure can also be found on the Commotion website. The link to the website is included in the video description. You can access options for general modifications for both your profile and the electronic lab journal by clicking on your username. The category Account and Profile allows you to specify the naming of reactions and samples. You can change your password here as well. Under My Affiliations, you may enter your affiliations to universities or other organizations. In this context, you can specify information such as country, organization, department, and working group. The section My Groups serves to pre-establish groups to facilitate sharing of ELN entries or collections. One benefit of this feature is that, in projects with several participants, you forego having to select each person individually every time you need to share new entries, therefore minimizing the likelihood of accidentally leaving somebody out. The menu button in the upper left-hand corner provides a quick overview of the ELN content. The ELN is structured using so-called collections, which aim to group the various content. There are certain collections which can be found in every instance of the ELN. One of these is the Commotion Collection, which allows you to transfer information from the ELN directly to the Commotion repository. Another example is the All Collection, which collects every entry of all the collections present in the ELN. Moreover, you can create additional individual collections by clicking on the gear icon with the red background. To display subdirectories or folders, click on the plus symbol. The tabs for shared content are listed underneath the personal collections. The difference between shared content and synchronized collections will be explained in detail in separate videos. The upper bar on the ELN overview page groups the possible operations which are available within the ELN. This includes a search field, as well as icons for moving, deleting, or sharing selected elements. Furthermore, you can access options for the import and export of data via the white button. The green tab lets you generate a report. With the help of the blue button, you can add items such as samples, reactions, or research plans to the current collection. The last tab provides options to generate labels for selected elements. Just underneath the action bar, you can find the list and detail level of the ELN. There is also a second grouping of tabs, which separately lists the items that you can create, such as samples and reactions. On the right-hand side, you have the display and sorting settings. The middle pane of the page displays the content and different items contained in the current collection.